I did kind of like the theme and the early line of all power comes from bloodshed. How lame is it that you actually play as Ayame before you know if she's good or evil? I mean, that's what I meant in the review of were they even trying to convince us of this plot twist. I mean, this is right after you first think that she was the traitor. I can appreciate a downer ending, but like the villain said, nothing was accomplished. You spend the entire game trying to figure out who did this whole thing. Apparently, the boss, enemy, or bad guy of one of the earlier games, I guess, they didn't tell me who it was. I haven't played any of the other games. I didn't know that this wasn't the first of the games. And they lose big time. And I don't even know if I should care about this kingdom being destroyed because I have no idea what kind of ruler Lord Goda was. The bad guy is essentially Callisto. But hey, I guess Xena the Warrior Princess can't patent that idea. And it is a good idea. You know, the whole concept of this one person hating this other person so much and calling them a killer and just trying to torture them and not really caring if they die themselves. Seriously, when Ricky Maru literally says, Oh, you I will just kill. I don't care about justice. Has he learned absolutely nothing? You're just a killer. How dare you say that? I will kill you and the girl that this entire game has been devoted to me and my partner I am in protecting. What the heck was with Ima's laugh at the end? Just at the end of the day, the entire game is pointless. You did nothing. You were led on a wild goose chase as both characters, the one person you were supposed to save died, by your hand, no less. The bad guy technically won. I mean, I don't mind depressing endings, but when everything you've done in the game has only led to something bad. At least, don't do that with an interactive medium. You can do that with a book or a film. When the player has put a lot of energy into reaching the end, you might want to consider awarding him something. Instead of just saying, oh, it was all for naught. Anyway, those were my thoughts on Tenchu Shadow Assassins. Hope you enjoyed it. I will see you next time.